everyone, we have just opened the doors of the Big Bang Fair 2017. All of the finalists are inside. They've set up their stands. We're about to go in. There's lots of excited people here. You looking forward to it? Okay, so the fair is split up into lots of different areas. You've got various stands from different sponsors, different universities, different potential jobs. You've also got stages. Morning. Right. You're right. You're right. You're right. He gets 10 points. You've got different stages for different shows. And then you've got all of these. These are all the stands for the Big Bang Competition finalists. Oh, judging is just starting to happen. Look, look, look. Oh, careful. Oh. <laughs> Never know what you're going to see. This is a barbecue in a Morris Minor. This is a car barbecue, yeah. Love the, t love the name of it. Firstly, what inspired you to put a barbecue in a car? Well, uh, Nigel over there taking photos uh, said, I want something for my garden, so it all came from there, really. One of the students said, that, oh, well, let, let's make a barbecue out of a car. So chop the car in half and put a barbecue in the front. So that's, 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 that's how it came about, really. <laughs> nice. Can I uh, have a play? Can we have a look? Yeah. Can you tell me what this is all about? Right, so basically this is our uh, project called Waterworld. Uh, it's all related to water and kind of flooding and that kind of thing. So this is our augmented reality sandbox that I can talk to you about. Yeah, please do. Right, so what we've basically got here, uh, as the kids are doing, is we've got an Xbox 360 Kinect sensor up there. Yeah. And it can detect different depths and different heights. And the way that works, so for example, the higher you go, the colours are going to get red and then you end up at white eventually and that represents the different heights and then the contour lines represent the steepness and this can be used in school for example in geography so to visualise U-shaped valleys and other geographical features which are normally quite difficult to understand for pupils and we're going to expand this project in the future by adding maybe like a weather simulation and maybe like have you know, wind and other kind of geographical things here. So this is only the beginning. Amazing. Yeah. Really love it. And I love right, the application for education yep. in Cheers. schools.